Hi guys. In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert a Python or Tkinter GUI into a dot exe. Actually, I have posted a video regarding this, but in that you have it will have lots of many folder will be created in the dot uh, exe you are creating. So in this video, it will be very simple. Only one exe will be executed. So for this, you need to have a pi installer installed how to know about how to install pi installer you can see my uh, videos um, it will be available below it is my first video actually so you need to copy that uh, python script into the script folder so so you need to copy and paste here oh wait wait I, okay again i will copy it Yeah, fine. So I have pasted it. So now I have to copy the address. Just copy the address and open the command prompt. Yeah, it's opening. Mm, just system is getting hanged. Just wait. Okay, again I will reopen. Yeah, fine. So just type cd and copy. So now you need to type this. So this is the important script. Py installer w underscore h. So this is the main script which do the function for us. Just like that. Then now we need to type the script name. So the name of the script you have copied into the uh, script folder of the python files. So and just copy it. Myself of uh, piston underscore cas dot py. So I'm just typing it. So then just now press enter. So code will be executed. So we can it will take some times based upon your system requirement. Okay, so as you can see, there are two folders are already created. This and build. So your Python, sorry, your uh, .exe file will be available inside the this folder. But for that, uh, you have to complete the operation to be completed. So let's wait. Again, just forward this video further and you can see it if you don't have patience. That's it. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's running. So, again, I tell you for doing this function, you need a pi installer installed. Okay, so pi installer is the main thing which does the function. You can just install pip method, just pip and install pi installer. That's it, it will do it. So if you don't know how to install Pi Installer, you can see the video already I have posted it. So the command is executing. Yeah, it's running, running, running. Let's watch it. So it's almost completed. Just few seconds or few minutes left. Come on, come on. Oh. So you have a high end RAM, high end processor. Sorry, high RAM and a high end processor. It will be very fast. Mine's a little bit slow. So fine. It's successfully completed. So now you can close it. And then you can see the inside the build folder. So it's just the files which are used to compile. So you can delete it. No need of that. So this is the so now a single ap uh, single dot exe file. So just open it. 
Okay, initially it may take some time because you know Python is a mm, sorry I forgot. Okay, so let's wait and watch. is happening because uh, it's very slow because that uh, I'm using that uh, screen recorder because of that uh, RAM is getting consumed more and process is also very heavy so that's why it's taking time so or else it will be fast Yeah, really guys because of that screen recorder it is not opening uh, fast so that's it okay so you need not to worry about it or it is slowly opening okay so finally yes it has been opened right so same simply you can type it as what i done in before and that's it so i have posted like this kind of videos before like playing with the taking the GUI from just from script you can develop how to develop to a graphical user interface and now you can see how easily you can convert that GUI to a .exe file so you can distribute it to any Windows PC so I'm in Windows 10 or Windows 7 so not a matter Python installed or not installed that is also matter okay guys so this is the final thanks for watching the video Have a nice day. Bye.